Hey, hi guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Janae Chanel and I make fashion beauty and lifestyle content and sometimes a little bit of college all right I'm like looking in the okay let me look at the camera <laughs> today I'm just gonna be doing a quick little get ready with me I'm doing my makeup and I'm gonna show you guys my outfit for class because I do have class today currently it is 10 56 and I have class at 12 30 but really near 11 and i have to film like this youtube video and i'm making a get ready with me like get dressed with me for tiktok too so i need to hurry up low-key high key actually so let's just go ahead and get started and hopefully my sound is okay because i don't have my mic today it's in my car and i don't feel like going to get it so hopefully the sound is okay but if not i'll try to like, but i'm gonna start it. with my eyebrows i already did my edges and i have braids so i'm not really gonna be doing my hair i might put it in a style i'm thinking about it but i gotta wait and see what accessories i'm gonna put with my outfit first and then we'll see if i'll do a style i'm not gonna lie y'all i feel like i should just make this chatty because i have so much to talk about for no reason and i know like it doesn't really matter to a lot of people what I'm talking about, but I just kind of need to get it off my chest. To be honest, I'm slicking my eyebrows down with a little bit of edge wax because the eyebrow wax does not work on my thick eyebrows. Hopefully it doesn't take me an hour to get ready like my girlfriend always says it does. I feel like my skin looks really good right now though. No? I don't know if I can tell on the camera because the camera always makes me look dead, but I don't know. <laughs> but it's the start of the semester it is the spring semester of my junior year currently and i am stressed i'm not gonna lie guys because okay well let me tell you everything i'm involved in first and then maybe you'll understand why i'm stressed first things first i take 18 credits this semester because i am doing a summer semester over the summer in new york for my study abroad requirement that i have to do so this semester i'm taking internship which is a class i need to take in order to graduate and instead of taking it in the summer i decided since i'm already in internship i'll just do it now and that definitely has helped me a lot because for one it'll help me save money and for two i'm already in an internship so for me to have to go out and like find another one or just wait till the summer i just feel like that's a lot so might as well just do it now there's internship for you also i'm currently styling for a magazine at my school i'm really really excited about it because you all know if you don't know I've recently started my own little styling business and even though I can't do like actual work for my business with the magazine, I just think it's definitely good for me to be, you know, involved with photo shoots and print work and just contributing to my school, you know? Cause I have not, listen, I'm a junior and I have not been involved in like, anything in school. Oh, I thought I wasn't recording for a second. But with that being said, internship and my organization's styling position that I'm currently in is a few things that I'm doing this semester. On top of that, I am still working. I'm still trying to work four to five days a week just because I have to pay my bills, you know? And your girl sometimes feels like she bit off more than she can chew, but I know I didn't because I can handle it. I can handle anything. And also, I need to do a lot of work for my small business as well. So I'm just like juggling all of that at once, which is honestly making me a little stressed on top of some other personal things in life. But you know, I guess everybody has to get through it. Sorry, I'm covering my whole face, but I'm trying to get my eyebrows together hopefully that doesn't look too bad i feel like lately my eyebrows have not been coming out how i've been wanting them to now i'm supposed to be making a tiktok at the same time hopefully i'm not too late i'm just gonna try to like record a few videos and try to see if i could like make a tiktok out of that i don't know wow the lighting looks really good right now though i'm using my little handheld mirror i got this from five below it's like not too cool too great but when i need a handheld mirror this is what i use Ooh, okay i'm multitasking here but i got my eyebrow outline done i'm just going to use my concealer really fast to clean it up and then oh did you guys get a good look at my nails? They still look good. And not one single nail has came off. Like, I really think I'm getting my nails down packed now. I'm really happy. I've had these on for like over a week and no nails have came off. So I'm really happy about that. Okay, so I'm gonna just clean up my eyebrows. But yeah, that's like a brief overview of everything that's going on in my current life right now. Kind of a lot, but I'm just trying to keep my head up and stay positive because... I know that I have to work hard now in order to get the life that I want and I deserve and you know my coming future plus I am a junior and I'm about to graduate so I feel like once I graduate I will definitely just feel like a relief like relieved that I don't have so much going on at once like instead of work and school and small business and this and that I'll just take one thing off the list which is school which I feel like helps a lot well it'll take school off internship and you know student organizations which if you're not involved in student orgs get involved this semester i don't care if it's your senior year just do it okay so now i'm just gonna take this elf oh, it has just on the inside but it's the elf putty 
poreless putty primer i'm just gonna put a little bit of that on because i put like a lot of product on my face i don't really wear foundation a lot but i do wear a lot of concealer so yeah i'm just gonna use this little brush here because i have my long nails i don't use my finger but this brush works really good anyway it's the real techniques brush square foundation brush so oh um what else was i gonna say i was gonna say something i'm trying to hurry up like i'm still taking long and i have so much to do i only have an hour like I guess like an hour and a half, but not really because I need to leave out early and make sure I get parking and all that good stuff. But I'm just gonna keep going. And also another thing, I feel like I don't really talk about school a lot on my channel. Like I just always say that I'm so busy and I'm so like overwhelmed, which first of all, it's 2023 and I need to stop doing that to be honest, because that's putting a lot of negative energy into the world. Even though it's not really me being negative, just me being honest. But, you know, the more I talk about being stressed about it, the more stressed I am about it. You feel me? So, I need to stop doing that. But, um, I'm just gonna blend this out really fast. This is actually the, I think it's the Fit Me concealer. Oh, no, I lied. I always say Fit Me, but it's Super Stay. Maybelline Super Stay concealer. 30 hours. I use this, like, every day. It's actually really good concealer, in my opinion. But, yeah. So, anyways, I don't feel like I talk about school as much as I should or as much as I can, like, in detail. Because I know it's, like, a lot. If you are anything like me and you're trying to, like, make it through school on your own, I'm in my junior year, bitch. We almost made it. So, you're going to make it, too, for one. And for two, like, I know it's, like, a lot right now, but I just have to keep reminding myself and reminding whoever else needs to hear this that all the work that you're putting in right now is going to pay off in just a few years like this work right now it's not going to last forever so whenever i get stressed i just try to remember that because sometimes it can really become too much i'm not gonna lie y'all me multitasking right now is so crazy like i'm turning here and recording and then i'm turning here and recording it's just a lot <laughs> anyways yeah moral of the story if you have a lot going on just remember that you won't have a lot going on forever one day it'll ease out and slow down a bit that is currently the biggest things in my life. I don't know, y'all. It's just something about using makeup brushes, like, over a beauty blender. It just always works out so good for me. Um, As far as, like, personal life, I'm doing okay. You know, it could be better, but it will be better in a few months. So, I'm not really too concerned about that. And I'm really just trying to focus on my content a lot. Because most of the time, I'm not going to lie, I get really caught up in school and everything that's going on. I don't really stick to as much content and put out as much content as I really want to. Or even as I plan to, because I do content plan now, like, for the month. And I have missed a few days this month, I'm not going to lie. But I've only missed, like, two days, which is, like, really good. Because I have content going out every single day. Every single day. So for me to only miss, like, two or three days, I feel like that's pretty good, you know? That's a lot better than old me was doing just a month ago. Hopefully you guys will be here to see the progress because all I know is this better pay off. It's a lot of work. Me trying to do content on top of everything else. That's another thing I forgot to say earlier. <laughs> this is all good. Like, at least everything that's going on. I might be stressed, but a lot of it is good stress, you know? Like, it's stuff that I should and need to be doing rather than something that's really bad. Okay, it's currently 11.12. I think that I can be able to finish my makeup by like 11.30 because I already got my base down. I have it down pretty well, so we shall see. But I'm feeling good about the process so far. I feel like if you make content a lot, then it's really important to keep doing research. I think that's one thing that I lacked a lot of, like, last year. I'm saying last year like it was so long ago, but I've really made a lot of changes in January. Like, to be honest, I'm pretty freaking proud of myself. I made a lot of changes in progress. The only progress that I really still need to work on is for my business because I keep prioritizing other things on top of it, and I need to make that a priority too because at the end of the day, my business is what I really, really want to be focusing on. Like, if I didn't have anything else to focus on, oh, my business would be skyrocketed right now. But, yeah, at the end of the day, I feel like I'm very focused right now, which is something that I wanted to do really bad. Because last year, I feel like I kept getting distracted a lot by just, like, random things, like, no excuse things type of vibe, which is not really what I want to be on, to be honest. So, yeah. But here's the beat so far. I feel like it looks good. Dust off a little powder and i literally have to work today but <laughs> it's okay to have two days in one day like first i go to class i do my content and then i come back and i go to work and do some school work at night that's the routine right now just putting on a little setting spray oh setting spray is so gross but yeah that is my base i feel like that's a pretty good base like it's pretty complete all i really have to do is put on a little bit of highlight in my eyelashes 
Mm -mm. Speaking of my business and everything, I've been thinking a lot about like corporate America, which I've been thinking about this for years. This is not something that I just started thinking about even before I even went to college. Like I was just wondering like, is that the lifestyle that I want to live? Is that the lifestyle for me? Because I've always, and my friend told me this on my birthday and it really made me realize that it's so true. I've always had like an entrepreneur spirit. I've always done something like on my own, on the side to make money and just express my creativity. And I feel like since I'm not a design major and I'm not going to be a fashion designer, well, not yet. I don't really feel like a lot of corporate roles will work out for me. Like the only one that I really do like is styling so i feel like when i graduate i'm trying to get my graduation plan together if you can't tell i'm probably most likely gonna start off like in like a corporate role but maybe not literal corporate office maybe just a regular nine to five so i could really just go to work and hopefully as a stylist and really work on my personal business a lot so eventually i will just only be working on my personal business sorry it's like really hard to talk while i'm trying to put on this eyelash hopefully that looks yeah, reasonable i don't know i feel like my lips look really plump right now Purr. but yeah my makeup is about done to be honest like all i have to do is Ooh, good thing i got that loose eyelash i almost went in my eye a little highlight on but yeah i'm really like done with my makeup i think i'm gonna leave the face highlight alone today just leave the feature highlight and i'm about done with my makeup like now all i really need to do is go get dressed and get my hair together and i'm gonna take y'all with me but the makeup is done what do y'all think? And we're doing good on time, y'all. It's only 11.27. I'm gonna go get dressed, and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm wearing. I just want everybody to know that I'm really putting in the work with this TikTok right now. But I'm getting dressed, and I'm gonna show y'all my outfit. I'm trying to get a good angle. But you know, like, YouTube, you can do sideways camera, horizontal. Let me try to show y'all. The bottom. I'm gonna wear these boots, by the way. So I'm gonna show you guys in a sec. Here are the boots in question. Ugh. Hopefully I get some good pics today. Cause ignore all the shoes all are on the floor, but here's the outfit guys. Hopefully you can see it. Let me give you a view of the bottom. And this is what I wear to school. But yeah, to be honest, this is gonna be the end of the video. I really, really, really hope you guys liked it. It was kind of a chat to get ready with me. I feel like I don't always talk that much in my chit chat, get ready with me, but I feel like I actually talked today. Hopefully, y'all think the same thing. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.